subscribe now. EU debates. Merci, Monsieur le. Thank you, President. Environmental crises are gaining in intensity. Our armed forces and our European Union missions and operations are faced with conditions that are ever more difficult to operate in. But these same armed forces are consumers of fossil fuels, but their emissions are not included in the Paris Agreement on the Climate. This resolution, therefore, uh, calls for the military activities to take to play their role in helping reduce uh, greenhouse gas emissions, whilst at the same time maintaining their operational effectiveness. In order to do that, we need a common methodology to measure emissions, and that's what we're uh, asking of High Representative Burrell. We also need to reduce the environmental impact of our military activities, be it airplanes, tanks, but also military buildings. We should be investing in energy efficiency and in new energies. One last thing I'd like to stress. Reducing the use of fossil fuels by the armed forces should also allow us to reduce our dependence on others. It's a fact that we are very dependent on third countries for fossil fuels. Without using fossil fuels, then, we can reinforce European strategic autonomy, which is ever and ever more necessary now. Ďakujem veľmi pekne.